coming at you full fledged. It's your boy Rage Man Rich with another video for y'all, man. Welcome, YouTube. So, I want y'all to check out the thumbnail, man. They uh, get at a read, man. Um, I had this in the vault for a while. Uh, I could have been a clout chasing dude and released it soon as I got it. This been like months old, but uh. I, I didn't do it because I don't really like, I don't really hold engaging with quote unquote celebrities as like the biggest thing in the world because I do it quite often, quiet as kept. <clears throat> uh, so this was a while ago. I think it was when it was, it was surrounding LeBron James and one of the many uh stats or uh milestones that he has uh achieved and uh they were talking about somebody i think uh, i don't remember the exact details but somebody i think it was on the post or in a comment something in the video was talking about how uh lebron james has practically made skip bayless's career and as a journalist, I don't I don't want to keep <laughs> I don't want to sound like Stephen A. Smith as a black man. <laughs> I ain't trying to sound like that, but I'm just saying like uh having a background that I do, I I I I, I had to call BS on that because Skip Bayless has been in the in the journalism sports world longer than some of these people have been alive to know that he's been around that long. And the fact that I knew that I I, I had to say something. And, uh, yes, has, has the question, the topic is not, has Skip Bayless gotten more famous for talking about LeBron James? The topic was, has LeBron James made the career of Skip Bayless? And I said something about it in the thumbnail, as y'all see. And I also was talking about, uh, James's, one of his very controversial nickname. I mean, well, it's not really controversial, uh, it's just uh, revealing. It's called the King. We know he. Uh, not to go on a tangent here, but this is something I, I watch a lot of. <laughs> this is a super tangent, but I watch a lot of videos, and uh, one of one of these dudes I watch is uh, I mentioned him a lot. I shot him a lot a couple of my videos. I was talking about this guy named Chronicles of Judah. He is a pro truth channel geared towards the so called black man, and sometimes he talks about the origin of the origins of uh, certain quote-unquote black people around the world. And he talks about how uh, most people's his last name, most black people's his last names aren't of quote-unquote slave owners, but that is their actual uh, uh, ancestral last name. Uh, and King, uh, King James, referring to LeBron James anyway, not to go on that tangent, King James, uh, if you watch, if you if you do your, you know, if you do your diligence, you know that he actually acknowledges he actually he that is a very frequent you uh, acknowledged uh, term, frequently frequently used term when it comes to acknowledging LeBron James. I I've I've heard where he even answers the phone saying. King speaking, so we know how important that nickname is to him. So somewhere in that post, they were talking about uh, somebody called him King or something like that, something to that aspect. And I said, "Man, y'all going too far with this King stuff, man. Y'all, I mean, King, I'm King of what? I mean, even well, it is kind of controversial because he was being called King of the NBA before he even played a game. So." And I mean, we we could talk about it from that aspect. We could talk about it from the narcissism aspect by him literally uh, having other people acknowledge him as king. <laughs> I mean, what is, what is he Roman Reigns or something? Like, but uh, yeah, I said I'm not acknowledging him as nothing. He, I, I mean, even to keep it completely objective, he's not the king of basketball. And we we can we can go weed him with that a million times. <laughs> But we talking about baby, but just just as a just as a as a grown man, I can see little little seven to 
11 year olds, anybody from elementary school to like 11 years old calling him king, man. Once you get to a certain age, man, and that fanboy stuff, man, that's for little kids and little girls. And, and I mean, little kids and women, not to sound crass or anything. And uh, I said something. No, it was Draymond Green. The, the whole dude I'm talking about in the video, he was saying something about LeBron James, and he was referring to him as King. So I was like, man, y'all tripping. Then eventually, eventually, Draymond responds and says, yeah, we calling him King, basically. And Draymond, bro, recently, Draymond went from when a, well, they always been frenemies, but Draymond went from one of this dude's to James's biggest ops. Draymond went from one of James's biggest ops to one of his biggest cheerleaders. And, I mean, we already know why that is. We, come on now. Clutch. He got the Clutch Sports Black card. I mean, come on now. Then, I mean, he 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 made his little statement. Draymond dropped his little response. To what I said, and it had all the fanboys going nuts. He didn't even have to say anything else. I knew he wasn't going to say anything else because he had all uh, the LeBron sexuals accompanying him. So he didn't. He didn't say nothing. And you know, I got attacked. Uh, <laughs> I got attacked. You know what I'm saying? By the fanboys, man. LeBron, dude. I. I, I Hey, I, I I I somewhat I somewhat give you credit how how you how you do it, man. It's like it's like you you um a mob boss of of some sorts. <laughs> but uh, Draymond Green, bro, he he's a weirdo. He he creeps me out, bro. Yeah, I can't. If I I've, I've said this before, if I'm Steph Curry. I'm talking to Draymond Green, bro. I'm like, what's going on, bro? Are you on the Warriors? Are you on the Lakers? Do you want LeBron to infiltrate us over here? Are you, uh, are you uh, obtaining intel from all what's going on over here and telling LeBron and telling him to tell the media? It's that deep. It's that deep. So yeah, man, these guys, bro. These guys, to, these guys are connected. <laughs> That's all I had to say in this video, man. Oh. Uh, yeah, bro, Draymond Green, he kind of creeped me out, bro. <laughs> hit that, hit that like button, man. Uh, comment at the beginning, middle, and end of the video. Share for us to see. Subscribe if you're new. Hit that notification bell so you can know, uh, be notified every time I drop. If there's a particular topic you want me to speak on, hit that link in the pinned comment section below and donate to the Rage, man. And I am...